Today I'm baking bread with flour from the wheat that I grew. Almost exactly 18 months ago, I was sharpening a sickle in readiness for my own harvest. Almost a year before that, growing wheat to make bread for my family had been no more than the kernel of an idea. We ploughed the acre in autumn and I sowed the grains by hand. I endured the winter, the great waiting as farmers used to call it, and I harvested with a sickle on a perfect late summer's day. Then came the interminable toil of threshing and the unexpected joy of winnowing. I took the grain to a local water mill to be milled into wholemeal flour. Back at home, I learned to mix knead and leaven dough with a gentle touch. And finally, I built a wood-fired oven in which to bake my bread. For me, baking bread at home is about self-reliance. It's about resting freedom from everyday necessity. For us as a family, it's also about limiting our exposure to the bewildering forces of the global economy by bringing the provenance of things we eat closer to home. The act of baking is a small protest, a declaration of domestic independence from corporations who seek complete control of a food system that has created an extraordinary plethora of environmental problems, not to mention the intractable human health issues. Baking bread at home is also, of course, about great tasting bread and the satisfaction of having created something yourself. When my loaves come out of the oven, the world is breaking someone else's heart.